One of the most powerful surface creation tools of Enroute software is the chamfer tool. And the chamfer tool is going to take a particular profile and go around the outside of a, a relief using this profile in one of several different methods. And so first I just have a shape here I'm going to take and it's just a little bit of a, a curved shape with uh, some tails at both ends. And we're just going to make a flat, no thickness relief. And oftentimes with the chamfer tool, we're not going to use a rounded or flat profile. We're just going to use a, a rounded or beveled profile. We're just going to use a flat one and then build upon that using the chamfer profile. So to start with, we just have a flat shape here. Now we go to the surface menu with this profile selected and we can go to the chamfer tool. And we have three different types of chamfering. The first is a center line chamfer. And I'm going to, it says, tells me to select the shape. I'm going to use this particular shape for the center line chamfer. Let's make it a height of 0.75 inches. And I'm going to hit the green check mark. And we're, there we can see we've, we've taken this profile and just sent it right between the, the two sides of this contour and created a nice looking 3D surface. All right. Now the next type of chamfer would be just a chamfer around the edge itself. And I'm going to go back here to the chamfer tool again. And we're going to choose just chamfer. And this is going to use just this profile and go around the shape. I'll tell it I'm going to replace it using this profile and hit my green check mark. And here we just get a nice, uh, a nice effect with a nice smooth surface, nice taper on the ends here, and a flat top. Because the chamfer tool is not going to make it meet in the middle. It's just going to keep the profile whatever size it is and then create the shape based upon that. So if I wanted it to reach a point in the middle, I would just come here and make my profile a little bit bigger. Then we use the chamfer tool again and hit the green check mark. So making the profile bigger will then give this, this shape a center line, uh, but also using just the chamfer tool. Now um, the, the Baroque chamfer, which is the one that creates the most impressive types of hand carved looks, is one that's gonna allow me to have a, a two different shapes, one for the inner and outer profile. Uh, and it will automatically switch from one side to the other on a shape like this, where you have a, a change in direction. So let's come back here last time and use the chamfer tool and go to chamfer carve. We're going to select this for the outside shape. We're going to select this for the inside shape, replace what's currently there and hit the green check mark. And now we can see that we've created a, a profile that actually switches from a, a concave to a convex surface as it travels around the outside of the part. So that's what we're going to use to create the kind of, of shape uh, that we've seen on the on the Enroute page. And here's actually the image that was used there. Now in this case, we have a whole bunch of different profiles that were going to be used and created separately, but they're all blending together in a way so that the center line or the edge of the, of the profile is going to meet right along the center line of this part. So we can actually select all these different components. And if I just zoom, uh, click and move on away, you can see how it looks there. We're going to select them all and create a flat, no thickness relief. Now we're going to go to the chamfer tool and use the Baroque chamfer carve. We're going to select the outer chamfer, the inner chamfer contour, and we're going to make this one inch in height and hit the green check mark. All right, using this uh, technique, we're, we're able to create a very nice looking design from a few different shapes that were drawn to blend in nicely together. And now we can select all these parts and come here and combine them together into a single part. And that's how you can use the chamfer tool to take some really nice profiles and create very nice 3D artistic work.